want to enhance your PageFly pages with powerful app integrations. Stay tuned to discover how you can easily add Shopify app blocks to your PageFly sections and pages, making your store more dynamic and engaging. Now, I will guide you on how to access the app block element. Firstly, you will need to access Page Editor. At the left side toolbar, click on the fourth icon, the Add Third Party Element function. Choose the app block element, drag and drop the element into the section editor, and then start using it. The Shopify app block element enables you to integrate app blocks from your existing apps directly into your PageFly pages or sections. This makes it simple to add extra content from the apps you use to your PageFly designs. Please note that the app block element can only be used with Shopify theme of 2.0 and this element can only be used once on a page. Next, it's configure the app block element. In the general tab, you can adjust the visibility, attributes, an animation of the element, and in the styling tab, you can customize the spacing, border style, effects, and advanced. Now I will guide you how to select an app to show on the app block element before accessing the app to show on the app block element. There are two things you need to do. It's publish the page live page and access the theme editor for the page. Once you've added a saved section to the theme editor, stick around for the next steps. Firstly, choose the Add Block button. Then in the Apps tab, you can either search for it in the bar at the top or just scroll down the list to find what you're looking for. In this example, we'll be adding the star rating from Stamped Product Review eJuicy app. We won't cover the app itself today, but there are plenty of resources online if you'd like to learn more. Lastly, click Save, and here's how the element will appear after it's been added. Last but not least is the use cases. In case you need to add something PageFly doesn't directly integrate with, no problem. The app block element lets you include content from other apps on your page. And this is the end of the tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe our channel to get more videos. Our friendly and knowledgeable team is available via live chat 24-7 to assist you with any issues. Thank you for watching.